here is uh, Bernie Sanders campaigning with Rob Quist. This was on Saturday uh, of this week. Thursday is the special election. And know that right now, poll came out, I guess it came out today, in the, Cal- uh, the Georgia 6th District race. John Ossoff running against Karen Handel. 51% to 44%, with 6% undecided. So I guess the 6% and the 51% are rounded up, or one figure is, because that's 101%. But this is uh, it's pretty good numbers. I don't know what's going to change the dynamic in that race, but... Here is Bernie Sanders uh, pushing for Quist in Montana. You know, when Rob began his campaign, a lot of people would say, well, you know, he's an interesting guy. He can play the guitar. He can sing. He's a poet. Wow, that's really cool. But he's not serious. He can't really win this election. Well, guess what? Just came back from Washington on Thursday, you have gotten the Republican leadership very, very nervous. There you go. And uh, they're also pretty nervous, I think, about what's happening in Georgia. All of this has big implications, and I've said this before, but I'll say it again, has even bigger implications for our politics than most then really, I think, you know, short of the, um, the special election for Ted Kennedy in the midst of attempting to do uh, health care reform and losing that seat to Scott Brown, these races, though they will not change the balance of power in the House, will certainly change the calculations of, uh, of Republicans and um, the ability for the Trump administration to get stuff through. Hey, Sam Cedar here. Uh, folks, you probably heard about the whole uh, YouTube uh, advertiser apocalypse. Well, we're suffering from it, too. We need your help. If you want to keep this show alive, you want us uh, to be able to still put out uh, clips on a regular basis, head over to our Patreon page. Here's the link right here or down below there. And uh, just give us a couple bucks a month uh, and support this program. Really appreciate it.